I'm pretty sure you guys already know by now I've made a bunch of shopping videos already and now I'm going to be going back to Ulta because a lot of you guys have requested Ulta as well and I actually do need to pick up a few things from there anyways so I thought Ulta would be super fun. Probably after this video I might switch it up a little bit and go back to like posting like different kind of content as well. I know you guys really love these kinds of videos but for the people that love like my routines and like my productive vlogs and stuff I'm gonna try and kind of you know film both if that makes sense we're gonna head there right now and i will see you guys when i'm there okay this one smells really good but i want to smell the orange one okay i think i like this one a little bit better and i just love how this shave butter looks but the blue one also is really pretty as well. And I see so many people on like the get ready with me TikToks use like an aftershave serum. I kind of want to try one, but I don't know which one. This one also looks super fun as well. This one is grape and grape is like one of my favorite scents. I've also tried Tree Hut's lip butter. This is really good as well. Sunbum lip balms are literally one of my favorites. I love the banana one. I've never tried the pomegranate though. The formula is super good on the banana one, so I mean, it's obviously going to be the same thing for this. So I think I might pick this up since summer's coming up. I literally had no idea they had like mini ones of these lotions. I've only seen the big ones, like the full size, but I love how cute these are. Okay, so this one, the Ocean Breeze, and then the Cucumber and Aloe, and the Sugared Banana. Those ones all smelled so good, but I really like the cucumber and aloe, and I really want to try out this moisturizer. Hopefully it's good. And then they also have body washes as well. I thought this brand only had like lotions and stuff, but you guys, I literally cannot even begin to explain how good this smells. I love banana. When I was younger, I used to be obsessed with these. I had a pink one and it was like my favorite thing ever. Okay, so this lip oil looks really good. I wanted to get this one. The shade number eight this one looks super nice and i feel like it would give a really nice tint to my lips so many people have talked so many good things about this so i really want to get it and i just love the florence bite mills packaging this is so cute i love the whale but i really wanted to try her lip oil but obviously it's out of stock and i have been wanting to color my hair so bad obviously put like highlights not like the whole thing and i would want to do pink but I literally have not had the balls to do it, even though I want to so bad. I'm just scared it's gonna mess up my hair. And if you guys need a good recommendation for like a brush, I always recommend the Tangle Teaser. I used to own one of these, but I have a wet brush now. I kind of want to get another Tangle Teaser again, but growing up, I would always use these. It was this one that I used to use all the time and like it would break every now and then, but I would always repurchase it. It was so good. And I'm looking at ColourPop right now, and I have never seen anything like this in my life. This is a serum blush. And then they also came out with tinted brow wax. I love this idea. But I literally just like opened it up, and it's kind of like hard. I don't know. That's kind of weird. But I was just looking at these, and these are like a gel eyeshadow, and I really like this. I want to get this shade right here. I don't know if they have it, actually. Hold on. So I was just looking. They do not have this shade right here, which sucks, because I feel like that would be super cute for like an inner corner highlight. But it's okay. It's totally fine. I don't even think I needed it, to be honest, so it's fine. So this looks super good. Hyaluronic Acid Intensive Cream from Coaster X. I recently just got the Snail Mucin Power Essence and I love this so much. So this one smells super good and it's huge, like it's literally like the size of my hand. And for 56 bucks, I feel like that isn't terrible. Just love this brand's packaging so much, I think it's so cute. I've always wanted to try a body glow oil for like the summer obviously. And I don't know any good brands for it, I don't know, I just saw this one and it just like reminded me of it. And then Tula also had like this face stick that I wanted to try out. I guess it's like an SPF thing. I'm not sure though. I'm gonna try and look for it right now. So I cannot find the face stick thing, but this moisturizer looks super nice as well. And I really like the formula for some reason. It's like thick, but it's thin. I don't know how to explain it. So I got this hand sanitizer in my other Ulta video. I think but I'm almost out of it, so I want to get this one right here, the citrus one. 
I honestly didn't really think that I'd be spending $10 on hand sanitizer, but I guess I am. So as you guys know, I've been trying to find a good shampoo and conditioner for a while. I've seen this brand a lot of times, but I don't know if it's good or not. Since my hair gets super oily, I want a clarifying shampoo, but I also don't know what brand to get, so I'm kind of stuck. You guys, I kind of want to get this because it just looks so pretty. Like, look at that. It's like iridescent or luminescent, whoops, but I love this. I'm definitely going to get this. Every time I see hair gummies, I always wonder if they even work. Like, like I don't think I've ever seen anyone tell me that these have worked. I don't know. So you guys saw me try out these clay masks in another video, and I had no idea they had like a bigger size, so I think I'm gonna pick this one up. You know, I think I might get this one because it has three and it also has an applicator, so yeah. Okay, um, I just walked over here and I saw that tree has a birthday cake scrub. That looks disgusting, but I'm also really curious to see if it's good, so. No. <laughs> and I walked over here to this clearance section without even knowing like what it was, and I see the way, I don't think this is on clearance, but they have a little mini one of the detox shampoo. I want to see if I can find a conditioner just so I can try it out. Because as you guys know, I've been wanting to try Way. Someone said it was a really good like shampoo and conditioner brand, so I want to try that out, see if it works for my hair. I'm so confused right now. They only have a mini one of the shampoo. They don't even have a conditioner. Like, I am looking, but there's no mini size of the conditioner, so I don't know what that's about. And I don't want to get like the big size just in case I don't like it, you know? I'd much rather get a smaller size and spend 30 bucks on both of them rather than on each of them. But I've also heard that tea tree is super good for your hair as well. And luckily they have many sizes right here of this, so I'd need to figure out which one I want. I guess it is the special one. I don't know what that means, but we're gonna put it in. You guys already know how much I love the brow glue from NYX. It's just the best, but they also have a brow mascara. So the wand is just a little thicker and longer, and this one has like a tiny little wand. I think I prefer this one just because I have more control. But guys, I literally just made like a quick loop and I came back to e.l.f. And I just love the way that these dew sticks look. I kind of want to get one. I don't know what the colors mean though. I don't know if you put this on your whole face or not. Okay, unfortunately, it is a highlighter. I don't know. I don't know what I thought. I was really confused for a second there. But I completely forgot that e.l.f. made a dupe of the Roller Lash by Benefit. I really want to try it out. I actually hope this is the dupe, because I can't really remember what the packaging looked like. I think this is it, though. So Milani has a new line. I think, I think this is new, actually. I've never seen it. But they have a lip mask, and this smells so good. It's like a citrus thing. I love it. But I literally get so many lip balms and lip masks and lip glosses, like I don't even need a new one, but like I want another one, you know? And CoverGirl also has a bunch of tints for like your blush, I guess, and I like these colors. I really like this pink one. Alright guys, so I just got off of work right now, that's why I look kind of busted, because I didn't have enough time to film the haul part of this video. So I'm gonna film it right now. So the first thing I got are these Freeman exotic mask blends this i actually kind of just got it mostly because of the applicator because the applicator looks cool and it actually comes with like a decent amount of face masks and this was like only 10 bucks so i think it's kind of a steal i also got this this is the soothing and liquid pearl luminescent serum from ogx i mostly just got it because i liked the way that it was like packaged i guess like i like the way that this looks i think it's really pretty I don't know what it's gonna do to my hair, but we'll see. I also got another Tree Hut sugar scrub. I feel like I'm always getting new ones of these because they always come out with like really good scents. And this one smells super good, so yeah. I also got a new Touchland hand sanitizer. I also did get another one of these like a few weeks ago, but I really, really like this. And like I said in the video, I cannot believe I'm spending 10 bucks on hand sanitizer, but I think it's worth it. I also got the e.l.f. Lash It Loud Volumizing Mascara. This is the Roller Lash dupe from Benefit, so let's hope it's good. I've actually never tried the Benefit one, but we'll see. And then I got the e.l.f. Power Grip Primer. I'm probably going to try this out in a future video soon, just because 
everyone has been trying this and I just kind of wanted to see what the hype is all about. And then I got two shampoo and conditioners. This is from Tea Tree and supposedly Tea Tree is really good for your hair. And then the last few things that I got were this Hemp's Cucumber and Aloe Moisturizer. I wish you guys could smell this. This smells so good and I think it's like pretty cool to like keep around in my bag. And then I also got the NYX Fat Oil. I saw this on a TikTok and it looked really good and I've never tried any of NYX's lip products. At least I don't think I have but I really like the color of this. And then since summer is coming up and it's also getting a lot hotter in California, I got a nice little SPF lip balm. This is the Sunbum one in pomegranate. Never tried the pomegranate. I've only ever tried the banana one and I love the banana one. So I got a pomegranate one. But yeah, that is everything that I got from Ulta today. I had so much fun shopping and I really hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know in the comments any other video ideas that you guys have for me, any other stores that you guys want me to go to. I think for the next video, I'm going to switch it up a little bit, probably do something a little more different, like a routine or something like a productive vlog of some sort. But yeah, I hope you guys have an amazing rest of your day and I hope to see you guys all in my next video. Bye!